construction of a circle using a pair of compasses. Get ready with a pair of compasses. Make sure it is level here. Sharp pencil. A circle with a radius 4cm. Radius always starts from the fixed point all the way to this circumference. So let's measure 4cm. Fixed point at 0, 4cm at the circumference of the pencil here. With this, this is going to be your 4 cm. Let's estimate. It will start from here and ends here. So definitely it's going to go beyond the box and go beyond the box down here as well. So let's start with the fixed point. With the cross, put your compass here. Hold it on top. Exit a little energy here. And then if you can stand and draw a circle. So if you are able to draw it nicely, it should be seamlessly connected here. So this is a circle with a radius of 4 cm, which is 4 cm at any point from the fixed point to the circumference. Fixed point, circumference. Nice. Let's draw one more circle with a diameter of 60 mm here. So diameter is a bit different. So we're going to understand what is a diameter. So diameter basically is point fixed point to circumference that's the radius and that's the radius all together this is diameter so if this is 60 mm all together I'm going to divide into two radius so 60 mm divided by 2 I'm going to get 30 mm so 30 mm here 30 mm here this is my small sketch, and this will be my circle. 30 mm can be also divided by 10 to get 3 cm here. So before I start, I must always estimate by using my compass. So again, fixed point at 0, 3 at the circumference. So my circle should start from here and end with here. Whoa. So it will start from here and end with here. I'm going to show you another way of drawing circle, which could be more convenient for some of you, is without rotating the pencil, but I'll rotating the paper this round. So very carefully, you hold the pencil here, and then just rotate the paper, rotate the paper, and if everything goes well, it should connect to the starting point seamlessly here. So let's take a closer look. So this would be my fixed point and with a diameter of 60 mm. Let's check. This is one of the circumference and this is another end and this is exactly falling at 